What is up guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can update the software on your 404 Mark II. Now obviously a lot of you are waiting for this device but there are people that are picking these up now and it looks like the software updates are going to be coming thick and fast for this machine. So I wanted to make sure this was up on the channel just so you guys can reference it really quickly. Maybe you want to bookmark it and come back to it later when you need to do it. It's super simple to do and I'll walk you through the whole process now. So the first thing you need to do on your computer is go to the Roland website and here you can see that I'm on the products page for the SP404 Mark II. Scroll down and I've already clicked the downloads tab there so I'm on that specific part of the product page. Then we can go to the system program. You can see that it says version 1.13 so that's the latest version. You can read all about the version there but I'm just going to scroll to the bottom and click download the files. So here's the zip that you get from the website. I'm going to go ahead and double click that to extract it and then go inside that and you will see that there's the two updater files, they're both .bin files. Those are the two files that you need to put on your SP404 SD card in order to update it. And these files need to go onto the root of the SD card. So you can see here I've actually already got an old update still on it. So I need to get rid of these two files because that's an old update. Then I'll go ahead to the download, copy those and put them on the root of the SD card there. Right, now that that's done, we just need to go ahead and take out the SD card and plug that into the actual device. Right, once you've done everything at your computer, like I've just shown you there, you're now at your SP404 Mark II. I've got my SD card here. First thing I'm going to do is put the SD card in, but I'm not going to switch the device on yet. So that goes into the side of the device like that. Okay, so once the SD card is inside the device, you need to switch it on, but you need to be holding shift while you do it. So I'm going to put my finger on shift, which is here. Turn the device on and an update screen will come up which says they're not found but then it quickly changes to saying it is found so make sure you just be patient and wait for it to change so I'll show you what happens here. You can see it said no updated but now it says that they have been found so update sure question mark which isn't the best English but we understand what it means and enter is push enter on the new value dial that we've got here so let's go ahead and press that and as you can see the device is now updating for us. Right, that's done now. It's saying both the updates have been installed. It says OK next to both of those. And now it says, please complete, please power off. So all you need to do now is turn the device off and then turn it back on again. But this time, obviously, you don't want to be holding shift. You just want to boot it up like you do normally. The device looks like it's working normally. So what I'm going to do is go into utility, which is shift and 13. I'm going to go to system and I'm going to scroll all the way across. And as you can see, my version is now 1.13, which is the latest version of the software. So that's exactly how you update the software on your SP404 Mark II.